Hey, what's up, everybody? I got a couple of cool things today. First up, I got a new monocle. It's right in there. You can't see it because it's a contact, but um, not a real monocle, but I, that's what I refer to it as. I also got um, the birds on Blu-ray, which inspired my painting of Tippy Hedron that I posted up um, a little bit earlier tonight. And also, I got this nice loot crate. Um, it's really heavy, so I have... No idea what's inside, but it could be fun. Maybe it'll be a, a figure of some sort or a toy. Um, so let's open it up and see. The theme is play for this month. So let's see what kind of things we can use to play because that could really mean anything. <clears throat> Ooh! I got a blank money, which is something I've been wanting to get for a while now. Because I can paint it and de decorate it myself. Um, nice. So, now I have a project. An art project to complete. Thanks, Loot Crate. Little baggie of dye. That. <laughs> Instead of numbers, it's got various... Uh, hand gestures. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm sure that'll come in handy. Uh, let's see what else. A hex bug. That's kind of cool. Micro robotic creatures. It's an ant. Have to figure out what to do with that. It's pretty. Looks almost like a hair clip. Super Fight Loot Crate Deck. This is a 100 card version of the viral card game Super Fight designed exclusively for Loot Crate by Skybound. These cards are only available in this exclusive deck. Create hilarious fighters with these cards, then argue over who would win in a fight between them. Hmm, that sounds uh, like it could be really fun. I'm actually going to open it to see what kind of cards these are because I've never heard of this game um, but it sounds like it could be really silly which of course is good to me so for example you could have King Kong you could have Ash which hmm, I wonder which Ash because there are a couple of Ashes that I enjoy um, Mothra, Loch Ness Monster Honey Badger, Swarm of Piranhas. So those are the white cards, which I'm not sure. Um, okay, so white cards seem to be characters. Black cards uh, have descriptions such as is really, really emotional. The character has flaming hands. The character can only be killed by a stake through the heart, that kind of thing. Those are black cards. Then blue cards have things like Godzilla's stomach. Old rope bridge over lava, on a roller coaster, deep in the Amazon forest, that kind of thing. <clears throat> and then purple cards, the fourth color. All fighters armed with chainsaws, all fighters armed with gasoline squirt guns, fighters cannot see or hear, that kind of thing. So, it's, it almost feels like um, Cards Against Humanity, but in a fighting deck type of game, which actually is pretty awesome. Um, put things together and see how it plays out. Um, Danny Montooth, we're going to play. And whoever else wants to join us. Let's see what else is in here. Ready Player One, New York Times bestseller. Has anyone read this? I haven't. So now I have a new book to read. Written by Ernest Klein. Enchanting. Willy Wonka meets the Matrix, says USA Today. That that catches my attention. So, got a new book. I actually am enjoying this loot crate since I had no idea what to expect. But um, here's a little book that comes in every month's loot loot crate. Um, it's got little cutout pieces that you can play with. <clears throat> here's the button. That comes with every loot crate. February 2015, play. 
Won't you play with me? Firefly online. I can unlock this gun using this code. These are instructions on how to use your uh, the little cutout pieces and the box. <clears throat> the box is actually a, a board game. So the cutout pieces that I was saying were in the, the monthly book can be used as pieces for the board game. And these are the instructions to show you how. And finally, a poster. little mini poster of oh cute it's Pac-Man how the tabletop game was designed it's pretty cool I used to love one of my favorite things going to Pizza Hut when I was little was waiting in the lobby for our table and playing the tabletop Pac-Man video game to love that. Um, I saw one recently which surprised me. I can't remember where it was. It wasn't in Pizza Hut because I haven't been inside of Pizza Hut in years. Um, but yeah, it was really cool to see that. It was very nostalgic and brought back lots of memories as did that poster just now. Um, so yeah, this was a cool loot crate. I'm really excited about this card deck. I'm really excited about this book that I've never heard of but now I get to read. And I'm mostly excited about this blank money because now I can get creative and have some fun um, got some ideas of what I should do with it let me know write in the comments below and uh, maybe I'll pick one of your ideas to decorate this money but thanks for tuning in for another loot crate and I will see you soon deuces